this is Pam from NortheastWheelsEvents.com at the 2018 Buick Northeast Nationals. We're checking out this 1916 Buick. Now, uh, touring car. The reason why I really wanted to show you this, first off, you know my affinity. I love the earlier cars. Uh, I want to show you around. Buick, of course, was always known for their valve and head engine, but did you realize it's all exposed? Let's check out under the hood here. Do you know what that is? Hooked up to the distributor, goes along the water pump, and drives the fan. That's your starter motor, folks. Remember, 14 was the first year for starter motors. It was a big, uh, uh, fairly small motor, actually, from National Cash Register. And they discovered if you over, it's a strong motor, but they could overload it enough to start a car. Now, you notice another accessory over here with this line coming off. And to engage and disengage, let's follow this line. Have you guessed what it is yet? Yep, that fills your tires. That is a pump. You've got the accessory, there's the uh, gauge right over there. Is that good or what? Now just keep showing you around uh, the earlier cars. Uh, notice the bevel glass. These bodies were all wood frame with literally the tin uh, nailed onto it right over. Uh, another feature I want to show you, you notice the rear brakes. There's no front brakes, it's all rear. It's an external uh, brake, all mechanical, and it just squeezes down. It's an external contracting brake. It's just on the rear, so you can imagine what kind of hairy situation you'll get into with this car. Again, this is 1916 Buick. You notice the tail light, singular. Gas tank back there, fill her up. There is no gas gauge. These are really beautiful cars, and these were fairly big for their day. They're quite spry. Let's take a look at the interior. Very simple. Again, this is very open. You can see how the body cuts in. You're sitting truly in between. You've got your spark and um, throttle up on top. You can see the uh, pedals down there, and that little round pedal is your starter motor. Uh, another thing I want to point out is that is uh, on the back, that's actually for a blanket because that's the only heat you have. Look at that back seat, notice the top hat. The back seat, if you notice, actually you sit in back of the rear axle. That's why there were such jouncy rides. They were just getting this stuff done. This was all off of the horse and buggy. Still in that age. Another thing which I always liked, non-skid, great tread design. You can see, of course, the straight axle and no brakes. You still had the crank handle over there, just for emergencies. Again, this is 1916 Buick. This is Pam from NortheastWheelsEvents.com at the 2018 Buick Northeast Region uh, Regional Meet. For more cool events like this, make sure you check NortheastWheelsEvents.com, SoutheastWheelsEvents.com, UKWheelsEvents.com, and while you're there, post and share your events. I want to show you one more feature. See the windshield wiper? With the handle, you can just barely make it out. Let's see if I can brighten this up. There you go, you see the handle? It wasn't even vacuum, folks, that's it. And that, by the way, was invented by a woman. This is Pam from NortheastWheelsEvents.com. I'll see you all at the shows.